hello everybody and we're back with some more Zelda Twilight Princess so what just happened if you didn't see the end we'll replay this part again uh, you are trapped in a cell by these shadow beasts well you don't know what they're called yet but um, you meet Minda so you, you move around a bit and you're kinda stuck here so um, you can't really do anything so uh, it goes in this cutscene and uh, you can just uh, watch. So. so you got this creepy little demon thing in your cell. And then she smiles. So what she does is she tries to help you out of here. So uh, let's see if I can do a voice for this. I found you! Oh, aren't you scary? <laughs> Are you sure you want to be doing that? Starling and glaring at me? Well, that's too bad. I was planning on helping you if you are nice. <laughs> that's much better. You humans are so obedient to a fault, aren't you? Oops, but you aren't a human anymore, are you? Yeah. You're a beast. <laughs> okay, I'm done with that creepy voice. So there, there, boy, you uh, be a good boy and calm down. No need to bite. So she uses this dark magic stuff to break you out of the chains. So there you go. And then uh, she teleports uh, outside of this cell thing using her magic. So she'll make you a deal if you get out. So she starts yawning, and you have to try getting out of here. This actually stumped me when I first got the game. But you have to use your shadow senses, or dog senses, canine. Um, I forget how to do that, but I know where it is. So you have to, have to hop at this. Wait, how do you attack? There's somewhere right here. I think I have to break that. Oh, oh, it's like sword. I forgot how to play this game. Huh. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I remember how to get. Can you use your shadow senses yet? Uh. Oh, there we go. so she's chilling on you um so she'll um listen i like you so i'll uh, i think i'll get you out of here but in exchange for my help you have to do exactly as i say if you need anything from me just press the up button to give me a sign Oh, right. So you all go through this door. And you have to bite on it. So you have to bite on a lever. And then go I'll go down here. And there's a soul. So we have to use our B senses. Um, so right now those are souls, um, it's a spirit, and there's a lot of spirits because of the shadows, and you turn into a weird creature once the shadows possess the land. So, I'm not sure what that did. Oh, whoa. I think that thing just jumped on the spikes. Alright, so... So we have to allow water flow so we can get over the spikes. And 
and then we have to cut off water so we can um, go through a door or something. So we gotta run over here. Alright, so let's run over here. And I know there's some trick ones like this. These shadow things are gonna come out of the darkness. So let's run over here. And then once again, she does this jerky, pricky thing. And she... So what you have to do is you have to get under that hole right there. So we have to go find another one of those chains. Uh. Oh, let's get out of the water. Oh, damn it. Haha, <laughs> cutscene. Can't touch me. Oh, okay, that was no fair. That was no fair. What the heck? You're kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, so we're gonna do this again. It's really easy though. I just don't know why I died. Um, I was stupid. That's why. Uh, okay, where are we? Where are we? Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, we got to do this again really quickly. I swear it won't take as long. Because we don't have to explain all this stuff. So I'll just quickly go through this. Damn it. Come back here. Okay, so allow the water back in. Now what we have to do is run back over, just like I showed you guys last time. Alright, so now we get this cutscene and the water flows out. So now we can run into that tunnel that Minda was showing us and laughing at us because we couldn't teleport through walls. You little shadow baby. Alright, so we run over here. And she goes through again. Stupid cutscene. Okay, so uh, now we run over here. And there's a small little tunnel. So now what we do is we run to the other side, and okay, uh, right at this part we have to go up this uh, staircase type thing. I know it looks pretty challenging, but it's very easy. If you haven't played this game, what you have to do, do, not do, oh, uh, fail, fail. Okay, that won't happen again. Because that was a fail. Alright, let's do this again. Oh, right, I have to use Minda. Ha! I'm stupid. Ouch. I got this. I guess I have to do everything for you. I'll guide you uh, to sure food footing, so target me with Z and follow me with A. Alright, so you have to do that quickly or I'll see trip. I don't even want to fight those things, so I have to, don't have to fall back down. Alright. So we have to carefully walk this type rope. You just have to make sure you don't click any other thing but forward. So let's get her over there. Ouch. Alright, and we're here. 
but because there's no way out, oh my gosh. All right. Okay, are there still more? Okay. So what we have to do, uh, we have to send her up to that pillar. There we go. All right, so we made it successfully. So now we're outside of the castle. We're trying to find a Zelda right now. I don't know why they call it the Legend of Zelda because it's Link, the main character, not Zelda. You only see her like once a game. And she's doing stupid stuff and always gets captured by Ganondorf. So, let's do this quickly. Oh, uh, look, there's someone I wanted to introduce you to, but uh, we'll need to go to the tower to do that. So we'll run back over quickly. I'm trying to skip through all this talking because I don't know if you guys want to watch this. And a guy's calling me on Skype. So one second. All right. So we're back quickly. That was just a second. I don't know if that came up on the video, but whatever. All right, so um, there's a, a soldier there that you could talk to. So there are even spirits up here, huh? This whole uh, spirit thing is pretty new to you, isn't it? Even though these guys can see those monsters, they don't know a thing about you. If you think I'm lying, why don't you check it out? Uh, hun, you're fine. Uh, oh, own your senses. Uh, own your fine senses with uh, the arrow keys. But I don't really care. Let's try to get to that tower. So what we have to do is we have to run over to this block and push it. Um, or you could do that. You usually have to push it, but I guess you didn't have to. Alright, so we have to take out this, this shadow crackhead. Um... And I'm getting team attack. Oh god! Oh fuck! Oh. oh my god! That wasn't my fault. That was uh, those ugly birds. All right, let's try to rush through this part. Alright, so we killed them. Let's get some health. Uh, uh are you kidding me? Okay, uh, I kind of forget. Um, oh, right, the bridge broke. Oh, so we're supposed to go here. Uh, look, just a little farther. So we have to use her to get across. And then, it's pretty easy the rest of the part. All we have to do is run along here. And go through that door. So now we meet Zelda, the famous princess. So let's run up and push through the door and there's a princess. <laughs> you remembered my name. That's an honor for me. That's my girl voice. Alright, so uh, he's not exactly what I had in mind, but I guess he'll do. You were imprisoned. I'm 
sorry. Okay, so he has no idea what's happening, so don't you think you should explain to him what you've managed to do? You owe, you owe him that much. Twilight Princess, he he. So it goes in this amazing cutscene, and I will get closer. Listen carefully. There was once a land of power, and the gods had um, the god uh, uh, of the gods was said to slumber. This once was the kingdom of Hyrule, but that blessed kingdom has been transformed by the king that rules the twilight. It has been turned into a world of shadows, ruled by creatures only who shun the light. So you can see this quick video. I'll be quiet. <laughs> Alright, so I, that's a pretty cool cutscene, guys. Uh, so basically what happened was uh, Zant took over, and according to Zelda, the kingdom uh, scumbled uh, to Twilight, but I, remem uh, but I remain its princess. So who this is, is it Zelda? We actually find it to be quite livable. I mean, it's perpetual twilight. Uh, really, all that bad? Minda, this is no time for levity. The shadow beasts have been searching far and wide for you. Why is this? Why indeed you tell me? Ehehe? <laughs> time has grown short. The guard will soon make his rounds. You must leave here, quickly. Alright, so that's Zelda, guys. Um, the princess. And now we have to leave this uh, castle.
Alright, so we're just about done with this episode, guys. Just gonna do this cutscene quickly. So Minda jumps out of the window and the dog's like, Where are you going, Minda? And she just hops, no problem. Undead demon baby woman. Uh, well, do you understand where we are now? I guess a promise is a promise. So I'll let you go back to wherever you first tumbled into Twilight. But are you really sure you uh, you should be going back? Are you sure you aren't forgetting anything important? He, <laughs> do you uh, want to save them? Well, in that case, little Minda would be happy to help you. But, well, you'd have to be my servant, and uh, and like a servant, you'd have to do exactly as I say. Why don't you go back, uh, take a little time, and give it some thought. Hehehe. <laughs> so she warps you back, and that's the end, guys. See ya. Hello? Joey, you have to be- uh, call you back, okay? Okay, one sec, bye. Alright guys, we're back, and what happened was, um, the wolf, you actually, Link, uh, I forgot to mention one thing. Though you may have left the darkened realm, you haven't transformed back to your former self, and you won't anytime soon. Now why could that be? See you later. Alright, so what we have to do is leave this, but then something rudely interrupts us. Uh, I think, I think it's right down here. Uh, did you think I disappear? Listen, there's another thing I forgot to tell you. Don't you think you can just run off and save your friends? Because you can't. Just beyond that bridge is a land covered in twilight. Last time a shadow beast pulled you through the curtain of the twilight. But if you want to go back uh, that way, this time you'll need the cooperation from somebody from the twilight, like me. So you really have no choice but to do what I say. Saving your friends and all like that, well, that'll depend on your actions. Because you can never trust words, you know. Right now, I want a sword and shield. That'll suit me. Uh, you do understand me, don't you? <laughs> so, what do you, uh, what do you plan to do? While you're d uh, dwaddling here, the twilight continues to expand. Come on, hurry up. Alright guys, so this is the end of the episode. Uh, I'll see you guys next time, and we'll continue off here to find a sword and shield to go back into the twilight. Peace.